Hi everybody, I'm Michelle from All Sorts, and I'm participating in the One Box Challenge New Year 2019. This is being hosted by Rachel at Sweet and Simple Home. I'm going to start by showing you my items, but I'm going to give you close-ups of each of them at the end of this video. So we're going to start with this rack okay it's too small i purchased it off of a local buy and sell site something like craigslist it's called kijiji uh, i picked it up in my neighborhood and i i haven't used it i picked it up about three years ago now i will donate this okay and i'll talk about where i'm donating at the end of the uh the video as well or towards the end there I can't remember how much I paid. I probably paid too much for something I never used. Okay, I did assemble it, but anyway, it's just kind of useless to me. I have drying racks that are much larger and they're much more useful. Here's a pair of pants that I purchased. These are not in the close-ups at the end of the video, okay? Just uh, a lot of the other stuff is but not the clothing I'm gonna donate them I've never worn them and time to give it away to someone who will wear it. and this pair of uh, stretchy corduroy like leggings look they're really nice it's a lovely color I mean it's a real autumn type color I would wear these in the autumn but I never did next items I have are these three goblet there's also something in here I'm going to show you in a minute. Anyway, these three goblets. They are pretty, but again, I don't use it. And there's also this sort of little trinkety thing. Again, close-ups at the end of the video. Okay. Here is something else I haven't used in a few years. This is a set of four. Actually, I'll just show you two because it's hard to hold all four. There's two purplish pink and two uh, yellowish gold votive holders. Okay, I was given these years ago. Here are the other two. A shot glass. Okay, I have shot glasses. I don't need it. It's taking up space in my hutch. And time to let go. A pair of mittens. Now, I'm going to try these on. I do find them too small. I find them very small around here. So I'm donating these mittens. It's really cold outside. Someone could use these. Now, this oil sprayer, it's by a name brand. I've used it once. I didn't like it. It's time consuming, pouring oil into it through a funnel. Not interested, okay? You can use a little brush if you want the same effect. Taking up space in my cabinets. Don't need it. Same for this item. This is really nice. It's a very nice design, but you know, I, I don't want to pour oil from a bottle into another bottle. I just don't have the time. It looks nice on my counter, but for me, useless. Now the next series of items are all in very new condition. Uh, hardly used and not used okay so i'm just going to pull these all out at once and go through them individually these are kind of art supplies and craft supplies now i had relatives visit me from the u.s in september and prior to them coming over i went out to the dollar store and purchased items to keep their children busy while they were visiting us but I didn't realize, you know, they were flying here and who needs to bring extra weight back to the U.S. in a carry-on bag when you're limited as it is? So, pencil crayons, a set of markers, googly eye stickers, gem stickers, I'm not donating these to where I'm donating everything I'm else. I'm going to donate these to a child care center. Look at all the paper. There's two of them. I think the children who were here may have used one page each. 
Look. Very useful for a child care center. Now, I didn't look close when I purchased these, but these are for adults, I guess. Well, I mean, children could use them if they wanted to, but there's two. So Ocean Wonders and Flower Power. There we go. They didn't use them, so I'm not using them. So I'm gonna donate them. Okay, so I've got this Nutribullet cookbook or, you know, recipe idea. Not interested. And last but not least, a copy of Nigella Bites. Now, I'll leave a link to the thrift store haul that I purchased this, but I have two copies. I don't have all of her cookbooks. So when I'm in the thrift store and I see one of her books, this was $5.99 by the way, I get really excited and I forget which book I actually have. I do not need two copies of Nigella Bites, okay? Someone will really enjoy this, okay? So there you go. That is my one box that I'm gonna donate. Now, let's talk about where I'm donating these items to. With exception to these two items, which I already told you where I'm donating, I'm gonna donate these items to the Salvation Army. I feel the Salvation Army does a lot of work in my community, and they also give, I think, a $10 off coupon, and that coupon does not have a use-by date. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm going to put close-ups to some of the items I'm donating, and I'm also going to leave a link to Rachel from Sweet and Simple Home, the playlist she has put up for this challenge. Please check out the other videos.